Hello everyone, my name is Gobin Singh and I would like to talk about design of the major equipment which is methanol distillation column. So, in order to separate methanol from water, a distillation column C302 is designed. The top product mainly consists of methanol whereby the product will be kept into storage tank before selling it out to customers while the product at the bottom consists of wastewater with traces amount of methanol inside to be sent for wastewater treatment. The distillation column C302 is designed to operate at 327 kPa and at 70 degrees Celsius. Moving on to design methodology, there are 10 steps to design a distillation column that starts with calculation of number of stages of the distillation column, column height and diameter estimation, calculation of area involved in the internal design, design of wheel and sieve tray, design of head and closure of the distillation column, design of bolt flange joints, design of skirt support and finally design of nozzles. There are some important calculations that has been conducted to find some of the parameters like actual number of stages which can be found by determining the ideal number of stages and plate efficiency. After that, we can go ahead and calculate the column height by assuming a plate spacing of 18 inch. Next is column diameter estimation which can be evaluated by finding the column cross-sectional area and assuming a downcomer area that is 10% of total. Now, this figure shows the technical data sheet for distillation column and it is divided into three parts which is operating data that shows the dimension of the column like column diameter trace spacing and stripping and rectifying trace. The second row is the internal condition where the parameters of the feet, top and bottom is specified in terms of their physical and chemical properties like temperature, pressure, flow rate, density and viscosity. Third row is technical and mechanical data that outlines the thickness of nozzles, height of column, type of material use, number of holes in sieve tray and bolt sizing. Finally, this slide shows the technical drawing of the distillation column and it shows the front view of the distillation column, the hydrodynamic dimension, tray layout and hose layout. That's all from me. Thank you.